What is up y'all, Hotato here, back with another raid video against uh, one of the relatively recent heroes released, Lady Loki. Uh, I believe she came out in October, maybe? Or something like that. Uh, she looks really good, average mana, cleanser, does damage to all, and then applies those status effects to the other uh, heroes, um, and, you know, extra damage per status ailment. So kind of like Snow White and kind of like Bertilla, kind of like uh, who else does really low damage to all? Um, Vanda? 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 Something sort of so like weird if you say Vanda. Anyways, um, so this looks pretty cool. You put a level 23 mana troop on her and she'll be able to go, let's see, what does she have? Oh, she has a 27 crit troop. And so with the level 27 crit troop, unfortunately, she won't get the mana bonus, but on defense, it'll give her extra defensive stats compared to that, you know. So big 8% uh, difference could make a difference, but I'm going to see if I could take her on. I'm going to try and let's see. Let's take a nice little strong team here. I'm going to try my blues. Actually, I don't have any... Actually, yeah, uh, let me do my blues because I want to use costume cure just so I can get that effect thrown back at me. Give him the mana troop. Nope. Because uh, we want to test out um, this chick. So we got Onyx, we got cure costume cure for dis uh, you know, status ailments. I want to see if they uh, see how they get thrown back, see how strong she really is. Um, and this will also be a good gauge if you plan on using her on offense, because that's where she will mostly find her value. Oh shit, she can't find value if she's about to die. Um, okay, well, this is also a good test on durability. Can't she hold up? As of right now, I totally could have kicked her ass, um, but I left her alive just to see how much damage. Alright, um... 260 to 300 to each. Uh, not bad. 170% damage. I mean, like, really, it's you're not really banking on that as your, your core damage, you know? You're really hoping for... I'm trying to see if I can set her off again. <laughs> you know? Oh, shit. Ooh, she's still alive. Yeah, I'm just trying to set her off again just to see... Here we go. See how strong she really is again now. She goes off twice. Damn, killed Kirill. All right, let's do this. Let's go and oh, ho ho! That revive though. Okay, so there's another perk that you'll get from uh, from that fighter class, man. Just revive. It's really uh, it's really useful to have that revive. Sometimes really saves your ass, um, whether it's offense or defense. So great class. Definitely a terrible tank. Tell you that much. Um, so if you have her, you know, in, in this configuration, if you really wanted to have the most efficient, quote unquote, most efficient um, uh, team setup, you'd probably put Heimdall tank, Vela flank, put June on the end over there, Ursina maybe on the other side with Lady Loki, something like that. Um, or maybe, you know, the green, red, blue front three, something like that. What has you? Uh, that might be something that you could do, but I'm going to try again. Damn it. I want to see her throw status effects back on me. Oh, but she's going to die too fast. Gosh darn it. See, that's the problem with running her at tank. She's just going to die really fast. There's nothing you can do about it. So I'm going to try to do that. Um... Oh man, I don't want to kill her, but she's gonna die. Uh, what can I do? Maybe I could do that. That shouldn't kill her. Perfect. All right, now she can throw more status ailments back at me. Unless she dies. Please don't die. Please don't die. Please don't die. No, she's gonna die. Ah, come on. How do I test you when I can't? 
even use you. Ah. <sighs> Maybe we could try to revive her back with Heimdall? <laughs> I don't think we want that. Do we? Damn. That sucks. I was really hoping I could see all of those just get thrown back at me, see all of the damage happen. Um, I'm gonna see if Heimdall will, will revive her and then cross her fingers. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Alright. Let's try again. Uh, okay, let me take some non-strong colors because I've been a little lucky with those. Uh, let's take green. I don't have any... Oh, yeah, so we got Telluria. Um... Damn. Uh, all right, you know what? Let's do Tibby. Get that defense down. Or you know what? Damn, I can't even decide. <laughs> Let's do Gormak because he's now has he has a new whatever bonus. What has you? Uh, let's do Grave Maker for sure. And then let's do um, some more John, I guess. Do a three two again. <sighs> okay, please. Please don't don't kill her. Oh perfect. Okay. This is good. Perfect, perfect, perfect. I might not even try to win this one because I really want to test her out. Um so we should be able to do this. She will go off. Oh don't die, don't die, don't die. Oh thank you, thank you. Let's see. Okay. Another bump in damage there. Not a ton. Uh, not a ton on that attack. But a definitely bump in damage for sure. I don't want to kill her. That's the whole reason I'm not aiming at her. But I do want to kill this guy. Mm hmm. This is tough. Because, like, trying to avoid the tank with any of your colors is very, very tough. Uh, let's do that. She shouldn't go off. Or she should still- Oh no, she might die. <gasps> She's alive! Perfect! Alright, let's see how it goes. I think everyone's gonna be dead. Ooh! There we go. Okay. So not bad. Not bad. Damage is relatively low. Um... Yeah, she's not really that scary on defense because you totally can just avoid her. So if you do have her on defense and you care about being competitive, I was going to say political, are you for real? Anyways, if you care about being competitive, then definitely put her at flank or don't even use her at all and find someone else. Um, obviously, it's just super fun to play against, so thank you for putting her there. Uh, and I could totally see her in a red stack. She would be super fun on offense. Definitely um, better timed. And then you can get mana generation a little bit differently as well. So overall, Lady Loki's a great hero. Level her up if you got her. Y'all know the deal. So most of these Valhalla heroes coming out are pretty good. Um, you know, we got Frigg and Odin that are probably the most OP of the recent ones that got released. But overall, I'd say a lot of them are really balanced. We have Loki, Lady Loki, uh, Thor, very balanced heroes. We got Bira um, that got released last year as well that I think is a balanced hero as well. So a lot of balanced heroes out there, just a few uh, a few weirdos that are top in the charts. But anyways, thank you for watching the video. Let me know how you use Lady Loki down in the comments below if you have her and what you think about her. And as usual, thank you. Like, subscribe. Catch you on the next one. Peace.